this video is just one part of a series on do-it-yourself full body dog grooming, so be sure to check out the other videos in this series. Hey dudes, it's Whitney and Chloe here from Doodle Dudes and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to show you how to cut your dog's nails. In this video, I will be using traditional dog nail clippers. These ones are pretty great. They're ergonomic, easy to grip, comfortable to grip, very sharp and efficient, and they have a nail stopper so you can't cut the nail too short. I've linked to the nail clippers in the description below if you want to check them out. Nail clipping used to be my most dreaded part of the groom, mostly because Chloe always seemed so bothered by it. If you feel the same, please know that it is really important not to skip this step in the grooming process. That said, it is really important that you first have your dog's trust. Let her smell the tool. If she seems apprehensive, just take it easy and wait until she is more warmed up to the idea of getting her nails clipped. Now, if you want to cut the nail the traditional way, align the nail clippers so that they are angled at 45 degrees to follow the slant of the nail growth. You can trim the nails chunk by chunk so you don't hit the quick. I've never hit Chloe's quick before, but I do know that when they start bleeding, you can use styptic powder or cornstarch to stop the bleeding and seal the wound. Chloe is not a fan of getting her nail clipped in chunks like this, so I've learned that if I chisel at the nail instead, she is not as anxious. How do I know if a nail is short enough? Well, I do the ground test. After working on the nail, you can see now that it is no longer touching the ground and that Chloe won't be uncomfortable from it. Stay tuned for the next video in this series on do-it-yourself full body dog grooming. Thanks so much for watching! If you found this video valuable or enjoyable, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video! Later dudes!